well guys if you're looking to buy some cheap 8 ball pool coins then i want you guys to check out 8 ball store on facebook they are the best they got the best price and a fast delivery system so yeah guys go ahead and check them out i have put the link in the description below hello guys welcome back to another special 8 ball pool video and as you can see today it is friday and usually i do is play with my subscribers and i'm going to be showing you a few games from today and <clears throat> there's also another update that i might not be accepting new subscribers because of uh, there are so many subscribers are waiting in line and i usually play with just i think 20 or 30 subscribers per month and there are already 60 plus so i think i'm not going to be accepting for the next two months so but yeah guys please have some patience and everybody will get a chance to play and <clears throat> yeah so i think it's all right so i was playing with stripes and <clears throat> i'm kind of stuck <clears throat> i wanted to give him a snooker but that was a very very silly shot on my part and wapit from pakistan and he has a chance to win it. Actually, I combined sub subscribers game from last week and this week and just put them in one video because <clears throat> also I need to spend some time on WWE tournaments and hopefully I will get the ring uh, within the time frame, which is six days remaining from Friday. So that's going to be a nice bank shot and he missed an easy bank shot okay he missed an easy shot so okay so now i think i have a chance and i don't even know why i selected this but that was a wrong pocket my friend wrong pocket <clears throat> all right so we are going in the second game it is my break and yeah guys if you guys don't notice that i'm using a sniper queue i was very fortunate to get the offer and purchase this queue okay nice position for that 15 in the top pocket And again, a great position to open up the green. And right now, I think I'm going to have to go for the combo shot over here. <clears throat> but red is available, so. Okay, that was a nice pot. But again, we are end up ending up with a combo. <clears throat> Hopefully, we get it. And yes, we got it. But where am I going to be playing the black? That's the problem. And that was a very, very close shot. And now I think he will get it. <clears throat> I think he will be taking the black into the top pocket or he's setting up for a bottom left yep bottom left it is he almost got it and i think he was very lucky to get it again i'm gonna be trying to get this and i got it so a third and final game the score is one one and let's hit it Okay. Okay, that's a nice position shot. But what is he doing? I don't know. 
What was that? <clears throat> I need to open up that red. Where am I going to be playing the black? That's the problem. Unless I can remove this green. And that's the problem over here right now. <clears throat> Okay, yep, I tried to open up, but I failed an important game, and nah, I don't think so. I don't even know it's going to touch or no. Yep, exactly, that's the problem. And yep, this is how the game is over. Yeah, that that's the problem, and I didn't... I didn't select a good position for my last shot, and that is going to cost us this best, first best of three from last week. And okay, I think again he's going to select, and that's the perfect shot. And he got it. So, well played, my friend. Well played. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, it's a, it's a second game. But this game is from this week as from today. And yep, he has got some Berlin rings. And I am really, really scared of this guy. I definitely need to learn the bank shots and good positioning to play the Berlin. <clears throat> Hopefully, I will be starting Berlin uh, from next month. Yep. Hopefully, I will use my red to open up the orange with a forward spin. And let's see what happens. Wow, that was a very, very nice spin. The ball is still spinning right now. And I think we got it now. But the problem is, where am I going to be playing the black? That's the thing. I need, to, I need to do something with the green to open up the black. And I think I need to be at the top of the green. And I think we got it. I think so. I don't know, but I think we got it. Oh my god, that's the worst position on the black. I think it's available in the bottom pocket, but I misjudge it completely. <clears throat> and he has a ball in hand right now. 27 Berlin rings with legendary cues and Archangel Q. My goodness me. He is good. Okay, what 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 did he do? The best positional shot and I Okay, so that was a very, very careless mistake. And we have an easy bang shot, but I'm going to be using his green as a support in case we missed it. Exactly what I wanted to do. And that's the bottom line because the Stone Cold said so. Yeah, guys, I did purchase the Stone Cold Q because I'm a big fan of it. And all right, so it's his break. Archangel break. Wow. Okay, it should be easy, but again, an easy shot is missed. What is going on, bro? Relax. I think he's nervous right now. He's playing with me for the very first time. But I don't see why is he nervous. He has 27 Berlin rings. And yeah, exactly. I don't know, man. I don't know. I think we got the green with a fast shot. I wanted to actually disturb my stripes, but that was a failed attempt. Let's do a com combination shot. And, yep, easy yellow into the bottom pocket. But the problem is, where am I going to be playing this black right now? Lenny, you're going to have to wait. You're going to be the last subscriber for today. So, I don't even know what I'm going to do, but let's see what happens. 
Okay, at least I part something. All right, so I think he has a chance right now. And I think if he doesn't clear the table right now, he will not be getting any chance from me. <clears throat> yep, it is easy for level 248 to finish the table at this visit. And, okay, so easy. Okay, he should be taking the bottom right pocket. Okay, he selected the bottom left. Okay. That was... I didn't even see that comment. So moving on to the third game, uh, second game from today. And... Alright, so we're playing Frankenstein in Sydney table, actually. And... Alright. So it is his break. Well, okay, that was that was a very nice shot right there. The problem ball is he needs to be a very perfect angle on this yellow to putt the green. <clears throat> okay, that was a nice position shot. Let's see what he can do. And that's the problem, guys. He missed an easy combo. Well, it looks easy, but it is not easy. So, I think now we have a chance to finish the game. A bit of rod spin to make sure we don't end up behind the yellow for our snookers. So, okay. Now, I'm going to have to use a forward rod spin to go down the table. And... Well, now I'm forced to play a bank shot because I can't take the ball into the pocket or else we might scratch. And that was a silly, silly miss. I did not see that coming. I have no idea how I missed this one. And, okay, so. Okay, which pocket is going to be selecting? Okay, he's taking the top left pocket and he missed it so i think we will take the bottom left pocket and we can do this now i'm just showing him i'm going to be taking this pocket and it's an easy part for us <clears throat> yeah guys so if you're a subscriber and if you are in the group on kik and usually what i do is we select a time and on that time i send the text and first three people to reply to my text immediately win the chance to play with me for this for the very next few minutes. So, yeah, so actually he was also available. He replied to my text. And usually after that, I ask them which table you want to play. But we only have one rule, which is the Berlin rule on the black. Okay, so... I think I got it with a bit of a left spin. But at this point, I forgot that I also have a red. And look what happened. I snookered myself behind the red. And that actually gave him a chance to win this game. Yeah, pretty much open table it's it's very easy to pot and yeah he's clever he's taking the orange first because orange might be difficult from the other side of the table and again he was very lucky and again he was very lucky almost caught up behind my 11 and now where is he going to be taking the black Okay, so he's going for a defensive shot on a Sydney table. But I'm not going to let him uh, win this game without having to put up some effort. And I'm going to give him a good fight, guys. Don't worry. All right, so now I'm going to be snookering him full ball. And he'll be forced to play. I think he's in trouble right now. He just opened up the balls for me. And that's it. Okay, that was a very lucky shot. 
And I'm teaching the ball in the top middle pocket. And I think it should be easy. Oh, that was again very, very close indeed. So a victory on Sydney table, 2-0. And all right, guys, so this guy, actually, I played with him last week, but I was distracted by something and did not use the Berlin rule on the black. He was upset, so I told him, let's play again. He actually won 2-1 last week. And let's see what happens today, okay? So that's a very, very awkward break, but I'm going to try to open up some stuff, guys. Red, uh, black is actually not in a good position for me to win and on this visit i'm gonna have to try something guys i don't even know i think let's go with a forward spin or right a spin okay so that was a very very bad shot on my end sorry guys and i think he got it he doesn't have berlin ring but Okay, a miscalculated shot on his part. And still, guys, black is a Berlin rule, and that's a big problem for me. Where am I going to play this ball? I don't even know. Nah. That was way off target. Ibad is from Pakistan and level 85 is very, very good. He's using the Millionaire Q, which I do have. And I did a video also. Check it out on my channel. And I think he's going for the purple. And next ball is going to be orange. Exactly. He's perfectly lined up for the orange with a bit of a forward spin to make sure he crossed the black. An easy pop for the red. Perfect, man. Okay, he's going to be taking the black on a top middle pocket, which is the standard bank shot. And that's perfect, man. Well played. I wonder why is he not having a Berlin ring? I just wonder, man. Yes, dude, it is a best of three. I already told you with the Berlin rule. Okay, is he going for the galaxy break or what? No, he's not going for the galaxy. Okay, yeah, he is going for the galaxy break. And galaxy break failed him. Dude, galaxy, if you're watching this, look. You need to fix the galaxy break. Or I think he used the wrong, wrong side of the table or something. I don't know, man. So I'm trying to work my way out of... Now nah, I'm going for yellow. I was stuck on the red... Uh, okay, so he's telling me he's king of the world. Well, let's show him how we do it. And we finish the game right now. Let's do this. Perfect on the blue. And lost is orange. But again, black is a bit of a trouble for me. Where am I going to be playing the black? I don't know. And... Again, I stuck on the red, on the black. Sorry, guys. And that was a very, very bad shot on my end. Indeed, that's the very, very bad gameplay from my side. And no wonder why I don't play Berlin. You see, guys, that's the reason I don't like to go on Berlin tables. Because, all right, guys, look. With just one shot, he missed his chance. And immediately, I know, guys. Parting this black. He needs to disturb the black right now. Black on this side, on this very tight on the cushion, is not easy to pot. Trust me, guys. I think he needs to do something. If I was playing right now, I would do at least something to disturb that black and make sure to get to the... Okay, so he just tried it. And that was the wrong spin, dude. He's not going to even try right now. I think he's going for a bottom left pocket with a cushion shot first. That's impossible, dude. That is way impossible. And I think we got it now. 
Uh, I'm just going to be using a little bit rod spin to make sure. What? I used the right spin. Oh my God. Okay. So Lenny finally, ma'am, she's from Australia all the way from oh, Australia is way too far. All right. So bring it on. Let's do this. I just lost a 2-0 and I was very, very upset. I selected the right spin and the ball went left. Somebody explain this to me, please. If you're watching and if you are a good player, explain this shit to me, all right? So you see, guys, with one good shot, I just opened up my black. And the next ball is going to be purple. I wanted to move the purple, but now I think uh, I missed it. So I'm going to be trying an insane trick shot on the black. Hopefully it will work, but let's find out. Okay, that was not even close. Sorry. And what a pain in the neck. Ma'am, what did I do to you? And okay, she almost potted. She almost scratched. So, all right, let's do this. Well, she doesn't have a Berlin ring, but Archangel Q. And definitely some good Q collections. Look, she's Diamond Club. That is insane. I mean, all right, so... What? Oh, uh, that's the schoolboy error. Well, that's what happens when you don't select the back spin. And I'm just going to put an easy bang shot. Perfect. Yep, she was very, very unlucky on that part. And all right. Yeah, even I didn't see that coming. I mean, that was a silly pot, silly scratch. I wasn't expecting it. All right, let's find out what the Archangel break can do and... She only potted one ball, which was not supposed to be potted. Okay. All right. I'm going to be taking uh, stripes. The only problem ball right now is the red one. And I think now I'm in trouble. But that was a nice combo shot. And we actually did it. And oh, my God. All right. Really? Okay. I'm going to be using a backspin to disturb my red. But... Instead of touching the red, we lost the game by potting the black. That was a nice combo shot, man. Nice one. So 1-1, one, one, and it's the final game of the day, guys. And hopefully you guys are enjoying. And I think I'm in trouble, guys, right now because look where the orange and number seven is, the top, near the top cushion. And I'm going to have to try to disturb them. At some point, and okay, now I'm stuck, guys. I don't even know what to do. So I'm just gonna try to bring the cue ball at the same position as the red is right now to make sure she can't pot anything. And I'm only an inch short, otherwise, she would be stuck. Now she has an easy green to pot and. Good position for the orange as well. Orange can be going in the middle top pocket. Yes. And. Okay. Now she had a good chance to disturb all the balls. And exactly what she wanted to do. That was an amazing shot. Excellent shot from a level 209. And again, it is perfect. I think the game is over, guys. But, yep, that's going to be, that's the game over. Why did she use a backspin over here? She could have played a slow shot to play right in the top right pocket. And now look where the black ended. That's the problem. That was a very, very bad backspin shot. And that was really, really not necessary on that part. And... And now we have a chance. Okay. Now I'm going to have to use a back spin to open up the 10 and 13. Hopefully I don't scratch. It always happens like this. Every time I try to open with a back spin, I usually scratch. And what she told me, she's not good in the bang shots. 
Let's see what she can do. Oh, that was very, very close. She should have played that with a... Not a fast power like... Slow shot might have done it. And we can take the ball in the middle pocket, I think. Or we can take go back and play in the left top pocket. Easy shot. I was very, very lucky. And almost scratched in the middle. So, yeah, guys. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys in my next video. And if you have any questions, comments, just hit me up on Facebook or KIK. And I'll be happy to answer it to all of you guys. And again, there is another video on my pay, on my Facebook, uh, on my YouTube channel. Uh, you guys can ask me any questions and I'll be answering it to you next week. So yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed and wish me luck for getting the WWE tournament and WWE ring. And hopefully I'll be uploading the videos next week. So thank you guys.